You're watching From the Heart with John Willard. Hi, friends. John Willard here, gentleman poet and storyteller. Great show today about looking for spring. And if you like the video, please hit the thumbs up. And remember the subscribe button for CNA TV. Oh, the past comes most colorfully alive when it's told through the memories of those who really lived it. Discover the peace you've been searching for and begin to understand and experience what true happiness really is. As sunrise breaks into daylight, I smile. I'm glad to have had these moments. I'm thankful for the peace of this morning. Friends, I love the feeling of warm black dirt. My opening thought, to dig in one's own earth with one's own spade, does life hold anything better? After a long, cold, dreary, and somewhat housebound winter, I'm ever watchful for the first glimpse of spring. Oh, how it thrills my heart to spy birds at my feeders after their long vacation in southern climes. Or the red tulips and yellow daffodils bravely poking through a lingering blanket of late winter snow or the new buds promising fragrant blooms on the lilac bushes that my wife's grandmother planted some 75 years ago. Mm. What I miss most though, during the frigid, frosty months, is my connection to the soil and what it produces. Whether it's garden fresh vegetables, sun ripened fruits, or brilliant blooms brightening the country landscape. As strange as it may sound, I love the feel of warm black dirt running through my fingers. Mm. The outdoorsy smell of fresh, turned dirt on my work clothes. And yes, even a taste of morsel of dirt on my tongue. Mm -mm. In an almost spiritual way, dirt is the substance that ties me to the earth. Just as soil keeps plants firmly anchored, it also keeps me grounded in what's real and what's important. Working with my hands, tilling soil, planting seeds, watering sprouts, hoeing weeds, and harvesting crops yields such a rewarding sense of accomplishment. The first day of spring, I dig my fingers deep into the soft earth. Mm. I can feel its energy and my spirits soar. My closing thought. The foolish man seeks happiness in the distance. The wise grows it under his feet. 
brands. It's time for me to go. The pups are ready for their eats and treats. <laughs> Feel free to visit me on Twitter at John Willard 47. Please be safe in these challenging times. And I will see you again next week. Until then, this is John Willard from the farm.